Honey Boo Boo, Mama's Got No Money For Me. Jury over my college. Now, the last time I was talking about Honey Boo Boo, I was talking exactly about the money situation, about how the money situation is something that even her late daughter was avoiding talking to her about because at the end of the day, when it comes to June, well, she's a selfish person in a nutshell. And I also spoke about how the money itself in particular was something that definitely made Alana here afraid of going to college because she felt as if, you know, it was going to be a problem. Well, as I was uh, minding my own business, well, to be fair, I was looking for a different article, but then I came across this one here, and uh, that's why I'm here right now. But anyway, with that being said, though, it does say here that uh, Mama June family crisis is staying true to its name because Mama June and Honey Boo Boo are fighting over money, specifically cash for college. On Friday night's episode of the hit reality TV show, Mama June told her daughter Lana, better known as Honey Boo Boo, that she didn't have the money to help pay for her college tuition. Info that totally shocked the rest of of the family now of course this shocked a certain part of the family if you know what i mean because like i said before the late daughter saw this coming you know it was always expected but also on top of that it continued by saying meanwhile mj um said during the episode that she couldn't give her daughter any money because she's trying to rebuild her finances alana pointed pointed out she spent money on her husband justin truth thick gold chains and this is the thing isn't it a parent that prioritizes a partner over their children you know parents that a partner that isn't even a father or mother to their children do you see what i'm saying like and i really hate it when people do that you know i sit there sometimes i say to myself why would people have kids if they know that at one point in their life that they may actually you know prioritize another man over their kids it's bizarre and when i say i know what i'm saying is this if you have a child <laughs> <laughs> there are people in this world that when they have children they know that they're going to put their child first no matter what but then there's people that when they have children they're like well i'm gonna keep the baby because i'm pregnant and i'm gonna do my best if it works it works if it doesn't it doesn't being a parent is hard there isn't a handbook you know those kind of parents that's exactly what she is and those are the kind of parents that they will put over they will put somebody else over their own freaking children which is nothing but disgusting but also on top of that here continues by saying alana is not the only one feeding mama june is cheap uh cheaping out when it comes to her by the way her sister lauren pumpkin called her mom out um called her mom for not helping alana during the conversational Remember, Lauren and her husband, Josh, took on caring Alana while Mama June was in the throes of her drug addiction. So it's not surprising uh, Els takes her sis side on this one. Of course, absolutely not. It's not a surprise, is it now? Honey Boo Boo basically summed up her feelings in a later conversational, confessional, uh, straight up saying Mama June, Mama, saying Mama could help everyone else but when it came to her she said her mom's never gotten anything for her and it's so sad isn't it it is so freaking sad but the thing is though i want to know though when it comes to the father of the girls comes to the father of alana it is quite disappointing that even the father isn't really in the picture enough or even at all to you know be helping to be helping hand to his child because it is a damn shame that how, how children, children are supposed to have two parents but sometimes they, get, they can only rely on one parent. And then in some situations, they can rely on none of the parents. I mean, for me, myself in particular, I'm in a position my whole life where I ended up having to rely on no parent. You know what I mean? So I do understand the position that uh, Alana's in. I do understand, obviously, how she's been made to feel in this situation. And it is absolutely nothing but disgusting. But also on top of that, it does say, hey, by the way, Alana started college in fall. She studied nursing at Regis University in Colorado. And she says she's got 21K scholarship enough to make a dent in those college expenses for sure has for the dent in her relationship with mama june unclear if they'll worked that one out yet now here's the thing i would generally always try and show you guys some footage obviously that happened the obviously of let me slow myself down now generally speaking i do try and make content and then with my content i do try and show you guys footage of what's happened on the show but sadly when it comes to we tv yeah those them them, them <laughs> they be hella strict with the copyright you know what i mean that's why i don't ever really show none of their shows because if i did 
then obviously I'd be here all the time giving you guys updates on freaking uh, love after lockup, love during lockup, Mama June, the whole shebang. But sadly, they, these guys are hella, hella strict. <laughs> That's why obviously I'd not be showing you guys obviously little clips here and there. Otherwise, I would have shown you the clips or, uh, uh, as more evidence to exactly what went down in the most recent episode. But it is what it is. But with that being said, though, let me know exactly what you're thinking down below in the comment section and we can talk about it. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, peace.